Welcome back. It is time for our pet doctor segment. We got Dr. Larson here with just well, an adorable little stuffed animal. But who is this little? This boy? is Bear. Bear's 17 weeks old. He's a little Yorkie. Oh, he's just a tiny little guy, is what he is. He uh, is. He brought his friend along. Yeah, too. and he's actually going to help us out because he is suffering from the condition that we're going to talk exactly about. Exactly right, Tim. Today, and what is it? It's cryptorchidism. Okay, now what exactly does that mean? Cryptorchid really by definition is when uh, a testicle, maybe both of them, okay. don't descend into the scrotum. They s get stuck elsewhere in the body. Where, where do they get stuck at then? Well, it's a, the, a lot of people think, well, the testicle really is made in the scrotum and it grows there. Mm -hmm. Well, that's not at all true. Uh, the testicle forms an abdomen and it makes a pathway down through the abdomen through what's called the inguinal canal into the scrotum and that's where it resides and grows up bigger. Okay. But with the cryptorchid uh, puppy, that testicle somehow or another gets hung up someplace. Maybe it doesn't even make it to the inguinal canal. Maybe it gets too big to go through the inguinal canal. Maybe it gets stuck in the inguinal canal, but the whole thing is the same. The testicle didn't make it to where it should be. Okay. Uh, at what age does it normally descend down? By eight weeks of age, most puppies have their, uh, their testicle descended, but we'll give them, like little guys like uh, Bear, we'll give them 16 weeks. He's 17 weeks out. Now, he has cryptorchids. We got problems. Yep. Okay. Now, you brought along bear, a puppy. I did. Is this a dog, cat problem equally or? Not at all equally. Uh, we probably see 99% of the cryptorchids are dogs. Wow. That's so overwhelming. The cats are pretty, it's overwhelming. Yeah. It's pretty rare when we have a kitty that has it. Uh, is there a certain type of dog that might be more at risk? I'm holding one right now. Really? Okay. This is purebred small breeds of dogs that okay. are more likely to have cryptorchidism than uh, the bigger dogs, although any male dog can end up with it. So any male dog can, but little yeah, So ones, little guys uh, are at the highest okay. risk of it. You're a pet owner. How is there any way that you can tell this might be going on? Uh, most evident thing would be there's only one testicle in the scrotum. Okay. Now you're not going to notice that with the little bear. It's going to be as they get bigger. Yeah. Uh, but uh, as the, the puppy and do turns into a dog and it matures, then things start, uh, start changing. Mm -hmm. That testicle that didn't make it into the scrotum, Tim, it should, the testicle should produce testosterone, which is the male hormone, which is all good. But that testicle, because it's at a warmer body temperature, decides it's going to produce estrogen, the oh, female okay. hormone. So he has a conflict of interest going on yeah. in his body. Testicle uh, produce, in the scrotum produces uh, testosterone, the one in the, uh, in the abdomen produces estrogen. It makes the, the one in the uh, scrotum get smaller, maybe become cancerous, mm -hmm. and the one in the, in the abdomen likely will become cancerous sometime in their life. So it's not a good thing to keep that testicle Definitely something in the to take body. care of. Um, you kind of answered that earlier. Is this a hereditary problem? It is, Sam. Passed it down. Is. No, it's what we call autosomal uh, uh, recessive, meaning both mom and dad have to have the trait okay. for cryptorchidism before they can pass it on to the puppy. Okay. So breeders, beware if you have a dog that has cryptorchid uh, problems, don't breed it yeah. because you'll pass it on to the And offspring. how do you treat it? It's a, a surgical removal of the testicle. Okay. Now that testicle sometimes plays hide and seek because oh, okay. it's in the abdomen or maybe in the ankle now, we have to look for it. It takes two incisions. One will remove the testicle, send a scrotum if there is one in there. And the second incision is go find that other cryptorchid okay. testicle. But we don't want to leave it in there because it'll cause problems. All right, some good information there, Dr. Larson. Uh, stick with us. We will be coming right back.